Adam, off the back of the first win under the new manager last weekend, it was important you carried it on, and uh, that's a terrific win for you today. Yeah, three points um, in any Premier League match is, is, is huge, and a little bit relieved I felt at the end there. I think when they went down to 10 men, um, which quite often happens, it's, it proves more difficult, and it did today. I thought we took a lot, a lot of touches on the ball rather than moving it quick, and um, got in our own way at times, but persisted and you know Pascal coming up the trumps again with, with the goal which um, made it uh, made us made us get three points you'd be very pleased with your goal it's your, it's, it's your second for Brighton first this season it's a great finish great goal actually all round yeah I don't get many nowadays but um, I find in a bit of form at the minute a bit of rhythm um, I've played the last four or five games and um, yeah in a role that's you know enjoyable uh, I feel like I can find good spaces and always nice to contribute um, the style hasn't changed very much, has it, from, from Graham Potter to um, De Zerbe. It hasn't changed that much. If anything, you're even more patient um, with the ball than you were under Graham Potter. Yeah, obviously each manager has different ideas and um, different ways of working and, and there are similarities, of course. I think it's still going to take a little bit of time. Um, you know, we've got lots of games, another game on Wednesday, and uh, but the manager's uh, doing bits on the training pitch and... You know, over the winter break, I'm sure we'll, we'll get good hours in, uh, keep practicing. And uh, but listen, back-to-back -back wins in the Premier League's huge, especially for us for Brighton. And um, keep going. And, and the funny thing is, people say about Brighton they don't score enough goals given the quality of the build-up play. Five against Leicester, three at Anfield, four against Chelsea, three at Wolves. <laughs> Can I say something about that? I, I think uh, I think that's completely not rubbish. You know, um, especially the way we play. I think we get in great areas I think it's just about all of us contributing a little bit more um, you know if we want a, want a striker as good as Danny Welbeck then you know we need to we need to spend 80 90 million in my opinion in the English market so, so they don't exist they're not out there we need to just get better all of us take a bit more responsibility uh, when it gets into the final third and I mean Leandro played as strikers today so uh, it's on us he's done all right lately and it's probably on me to contribute a little bit more and uh, it was nice to do so today.